Ladies and gentlemen, the time has come. We are on chill video number five. And that means Black Ops 1, baby. One of the best zombies experiences there is. Especially diving up to this like this. Let's go! I was going to say, if I uh, killed myself there, I was just going to call it and upload the video just as that. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, I love Kino. It's so much fun, and it's definitely, definitely a nostalgic map, because there are maps that are better. Like, I think Therese is better than Kino, but, but, it's still just so much fun. It's one of the best, if not, huh, the best casual map of all time. So, yeah. I mean, of course, it's easy with the train, or the stage, because that's where everybody, at least that's where I learned how to train, so, you know. And of course, we're going to be representing the Olympia gang through these chill videos, because that's just how we do it here in the Jonah Kraut YouTube page. So, oop. <laughs> uh, but I think I'm not going to allow myself quick revive. I know I said no challenges in these chill videos, but like, I'm not trying to get to like round like infinity or something like that. If I want to do a high round attempt, I'll do that in the later thing, but this is all just for getting a nice casual playthrough and just chillaxing and letting my thoughts out. So, let's see how we do, shall we? I am predicting a pretty decent run because, again, it's it's Kino. Everybody, you know, knows and likes Kino. But then again, I got higher on Varuk than I did on Doris. So, <laughs> you never really know what's going to happen. Uh day to day given on how lucky you know you might be with drops or this or that so there's definitely a lot of RNG and luck in zombies and anybody who says different is a big stupid poopy pants I heard it here first folks and remember to stay hydrated in this hot hot summer especially when you're repping gamer guy skills like myself so I got my crocs and we're crocking out here so that's how you do it Especially playing Kino, because Crocs were first popular around that time, if I do remember correctly. 2010. So, very topical. Very topical and to the point. Oh, hello, everybody. All just coming at once, why don't ya? Doors open. Hey. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Well... Do I want to move on now or do I want to... I, you know what? I'm going to play this like I did when I was a kid. And when I was a kid, I would honestly just like stay in the starting room as long as I could. So, oh. So let's see how we can do that. I'm probably going to do a starting room challenge here eventually. I mean, I know I said that that's kind of like the cheesy, like everyone does kind of challenge. But it is still a challenge and a fun one. So I think I'm definitely going to do that. The question is what map. So... Comment below to tell me what map I should do the starting room challenge on. Or if you want to see it on multiple maps, I'm down for that too. So, y'all, just let me know what you think. And whether that would be more of like a freeform video like this or more like my edited ones. So, I would definitely be... Oop. <laughs> I would definitely be down to feedback for that, so... Alright, I'm gonna stay here till the first dog round. I think that sounds like a pretty good idea. Oh, oh, pardon me. Just gonna sneak right past you. Grab the ranch. Oh, there we go. Oh, excuse me. Let my Midwest roots out here for you. Oh, there's a lot of your fellas in here, aren't there? Alright. Let's clap these guys. Clap, clap. And let's get a double shot. Nope. Alright, cool beans. Yaw! Yeah. <laughs> Pardon me. Of course I'm going to be getting the other perks, like Jug, Speed, and that. That means I can get Mule Kick if I'm not worrying about Quick Revive, because when I'm done, I'm done. So that's actually not a horrible idea. Alright. Let's maximize the double point here. Dogs? Yes. As I say, I have the game volume turned down low, so I didn't actually even hear the music. Ugh, that's funny. Alright. 
I got... Oh, yeah, let's... Let's not. Let's not and say we did, huh? <laughs> oh, on my uh, Olympia only video, my attempting a comeback one, I almost died on a dog round, which would have been funny because I don't think I've... Well, yeah, I've definitely died on a dog round before. I mean, who am I kidding? But... <laughs> definitely been would have been a funny way to end this casual video because I said round five, so anything past round five goes in this raw dog in it content here. Alright, cool. So we have enough to get to the stage. Perfect. Ah, the old stomping grounds. Here we are. This is the map I got my highest round on. I mean, me and almost everyone else because, again, it's an easy map. So, because, like, I got to round 79, I believe. Yeah, that was my highest round I got to. Uh-oh. Don't, don't just hit me like that, you big jerk. Alright. <laughs> oh, I love Black Ops 1. Ow. Meanie. Oh, I'm so close to getting the box too, which I didn't even see where it's at. But, alright. Okay, where is it? And of course, it's in the alley. Great. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. This is fine. I'll just stick with my tried and true boy, the Olympia. <sighs> All right. Yes, the stage. The stage. All right, buddies. Come on in. Come on in. There's plenty of me to go around, boys. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. So, obviously... Like I said, Kino is a very fun and casual map for sure. I mean, it's probably one of the first maps that a lot of people played. I'm going to get killed doing something incredibly stupid. I can already feel it. I can feel it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to call this like a round eight. A round eight run. That's what I'm thinking. Because I'm going to go someplace or do something stupid. I... I'll take you. <laughs> I saw something um, the other day. It was uh, someone playing this on the Wii. It was uh, Dalek, yeah. Dalek playing this on the Wii. And apparently there's an AUG wall by right here that's exclusive to the Wii. And also on this version of it, this is like blocked off with just a brick wall. You can still get like behind here, but you just have to go around to either side. This is blocked off. I don't know why. Like, maybe they didn't want people having long sight lines or something because of the render distance, but I don't get it. So, I mean, who knows, but <laughs> it's just interesting, just little features like that and stuff. Obviously, you can still pack a punch and get all the perks, and there's no mule kick in it because that game didn't get any DLC because, I mean, <laughs> I don't think any of the Call of Duties have DLC on the Wii uh, because I know that... Um, their world at war didn't even have. Oh, nope, nope. Their world at war didn't even have zombies, and then also Black Ops 2 didn't have any of the DLCs. So, because that's on the Wii U, and it uh, actually runs pretty great on it. Thank you. Let's go this way. Mm -hmm. And I know, I know, I should be knifing on the insta-kill, but not with those stank boys around, see? Because I don't want something like that to happen. There we go. Alright, is that it? Yeah, let's get those double points. No! Oh, yeah. Alright, where's the last guy? Well, round seven, <laughs> not round eight, but I have enough to get Jug, so we're going to go that route, and I'll probably buy the M16. Let's get the most of this double points here, huh? All right, perfect. Or should I just flex and buy the Bowie knife instead? Uh, I think not. <laughs> perfect. 
get this, then I'll go buy the M16, so at least that way I am progressing like the soup. Do I want to keep... Mm, nah, I won't do Mustang and Sally. Not until Ascension when I can get PhD. But I'll, 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 make that, I'll make that promise now. So hold me accountable if I don't do it, boys. So, not that a lot of people watch these chill videos, but to those who do. <laughs> okay. Alright, am I still gonna die by doing something stupid? Oh, you betcha. Oh, you betcha. You a betcha. Oh. Clip my heels there, man. Let's get you out of the way. Man, I'm missing all these shots today, huh? What is that? Nuke. Should I get it? Eh, it is casual, so I'll just... Alright. Whee! Oh! <laughs> that was almost a bad move. <laughs> uh. <laughs> water break. Alright, well I beat round 8, so that's good. <laughs> Alright, well I still have the Olympia for the dog round, which is good. And not that it'll do anything to him, but these dogs are better than World at War dogs. They're not as vicious, so or well, vicious. I don't think they're I think these dogs aren't as strong as the World at War dogs, is what I'll say. But yeah, they're definitely not as weak as the Black Ops 3 dogs or 4 dogs. That's for dang sure. Those guys are pushovers. Come on, pop. One of you guys. Jeez. Oop. Oop, oop, oop. Oop, excuse me. Oop, excuse me. Let me just sneak right past ya. Perfect game for Midwesterners. Sneaking past the Zambos while saying "oop." See how many times you can say it. All right. Oop. Hello there. Da oh, hell. Da. Oh, I almost got through that. Oh, jeez. All right. Well, you know what? <laughs> we keep it. We keep it raw. And we keep it uncut for these chill videos. So when I fail catastrophically like that, it's fun. But. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm gonna give some, I'm gonna play a little bit more and kind of give some final thoughts on Kino, because it, it does launch back up into the game, so I will give some little final thoughts on Kino here. <laughs> um, obviously, like I said, it's one of my favorite casual maps of all time, it's a lot of people's first introduction into zombies. It's uh, fun, great, it's where a lot of people learn how to train, it has a good weapon variety introduced introduces one of the best wonder weapons of all time in the thunder gun so i really enjoy it from that regard um and they added mule kick so that really helps the black ops one ammo problem if you're doing something like that and you need a good other weapon because that makes weapons like the ballistic knife pack a punch ability where it revives people and the uh crossbow viable because you know you can use that as the mini monkey bombs and that gets upgraded so it definitely makes little kind of niche weapons like that more viable in situations so to everybody who watched me fail catastrophically at my Kino chill video thank you very much I know this is probably going to be the shortest one yet but I'm very thankful for everyone who watched subscribe if you want to see more epic fails and epic gamer moments those happen too and leave a like if it was your cup of tea. And thanks everybody for watching. Have a great day.